is your Cat 7 tip of the week. Janai Kerr, USA Olympian with 5meter.com, back here showing you some more tips in the pool of how to make a perfect lunge. Zero wasted movement. Okay. When it's a race between you and the ball to the corner, you don't have the luxury of making in un any unnecessary movements. Everything has to be in a direct line. Okay. As much as I don't love violence, if you imagine a fighter taking the time to pull back for a big punch versus a little quick jab is what you're trying to do. So when my hand's basically here for balance, not for support, my lead hand goes straight to the corner. The full lunge, okay, will be pushing with my off hand and a powerful breaststroke kick with my legs all simultaneously as my middle finger goes diagonally to the ball. I'm not as concerned much about length as I am about explosiveness, okay? Even a five foot goalie is gonna be able to cover 90% of the cage if they focus on getting to the ball before the ball gets to the goal line, okay? The angle that their hand is traveling is very important as well. About 15 degrees slightly forward. So not to the side, but everything slightly forward. Shoulder, elbow, wrist, fingertips each leaning in front of each other to meet the ball out front, okay? Once the ball's been released from a shooter, you can commit to making that block because you know they're not making the lob. Okay, I'm gonna do a full demonstration of four to five lunges, including over my head. As goalies, a lot of times we're gonna have a bit of going left, right, left, right, rather than making the game realistic. I'm gonna throw in some slides and some steps because there's traditionally a lot of passes between each shot. The last thing a lot of goalies ask me about is low shots and skip shots. A lot of people spend their time coming up, over and back down, rather than just me and the ball right there. As long as my collarbone's already out of the water, it's basically how quickly I can get my hand extended and pinky finger out of the water. So extended, pinky finger out of the water for a block. So a good drill is to go 10 times or so as quickly as you can. Add to this, you'll push with your off hand and you go at that same speed pushing with that off hand. Again, no wasted movement. And from this face position, you're ready to explode here, or over your head, or high corner. It's that same base position every single time. And that's your CWPA tip of the week.